Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to another video. It's been a little bit since I've posted in my summer vlog series, but I have a lot to share with you guys today. So if you are interested in hearing about a new supplement I'm currently taking and loving, if you're interested about hearing an update about my fear of flying and what I've been doing and a trip I've planned, um, stick around because there's a lot of stuff that's going to go into this video today would love to have you. Please subscribe if you are new and let's get into it. Okay, so first things first, I want to just briefly talk about a new supplement that I have been taking. And I decided to start taking this um, particular natural um, supplement is because I do struggle with anxiety and I have for a very long time. And it really came to a point uh, recently just with my changing hormones and perimenopause and all of the things that we've talked about. And if you haven't seen any of those videos, I will make sure to link some below, but I really wanted to try and get that under control. So I had done some research and discovered berberine and I'm going to go ahead and just put it across here, just the spelling of it. So if you haven't heard of it, it's actually been going viral on TikTok for another reason. A lot of creators are calling it nature's, nature's Ozempic, um, but that is not why I'm taking it. I'm taking it to help um, regulate my mood and help to regulate my anxiety disorder. I have been taking it now for about four weeks and I can tell you that I have seen a huge difference in the way that I am feeling, the way I'm managing my stress, um, and I feel like it's definitely been very helpful. Now, while I am no doctor and I am not giving you any medical advice, I just wanted to share a couple of the things that I have been noticing since taking it for four weeks. One, I have been one, feeling really energized. Two, I have been um, not having as many heart palpitations. I did some research on that because with my changing hormones, I had noticed that I was having a lot more um, heart palpitations and irregular heartbeats, which is just part of the changing levels in your estrogen and the spike and then the drop and all those things can kind of happen during perimenopause. And since I have been taking the berberine, I have noticed basically none of those irregular heartbeats. So definitely do a little bit of research on that because there is some sh uh, studies that are showing that it can be helpful for that. Um, and I think it has something to do with how it regulates your glucose levels or your blood sugar. Once again, not a doctor, just sharing from my personal experience. So do your own research. Um, secondly, I have noticed that I've been sleeping a lot better at night. Um, I was feeling like these odd periods of being bloated throughout the day before taking it. And I'm not feeling that at all. My rings are like falling off my fingers right now. I don't know if it's a placebo effect or what it is, but I would highly suggest looking into it if you are in perimenopause and um, you're looking for a natural supplement to combat some of those issues. Okay, so now that we've talked about the berberine, I also want to circle back and talk about my little series that I've been doing on here about my fear of flying. So I am ready to tackle that fear and an update. We have planned a trip to go to Lima, Peru for my husband's um, parents' 50th wedding anniversary. They are actually renewing their vows and we cannot be more excited for them. So we are leaving very, very soon on that trip and I plan to vlog the whole trip. I plan to take you guys along with me. I plan to take some resistance bands with me and do some workouts in some really neat places. We're gonna be there just for a short amount of time. So I'm gonna try to cram as much as I can into that vlog. Um, and really talk to you guys about how I've been working on overcoming my fear of flying. I do have another video coming up in the summer vlog series very soon, probably within the next couple of days um, on some information that has really been helpful for me. So if you guys are interested in following along that journey, I would love to have you subscribe if you are new here. We absolutely love Lima, Peru. We love the food there. We can't wait to just go and explore again and just have a great family trip. So I'm really, really excited um, to share with you guys how I'm gonna handle this nine hour flight. We are going straight from LAX all the way to Lima, Peru with no stops. And this is going to be a true test and challenge um, of how I'm doing with overcoming my fear of flying. So stick around if you'd like to see that journey. Third, I would like to invite you to join me on Instagram. If you don't already follow me on Instagram, I have a wonderful, supportive, fabulous uh, community over there. Uh, I think it's a really positive space, especially if you are on a fitness journey right now. But if you're just looking for some fun workouts, I would highly suggest following me over on Instagram. We have a really good time. Over there. I'm planning to do just a little bit, a little bit of footage today since it's a beautiful day on the Central Coast. Uh, maybe we'll do a little recipe or I'll show you guys what I'm eating for lunch. I don't know. You can follow me around if you are interested. Um, thank you so much for watching and let's get into the vlog. All right, so I'm always just trying to revamp my space in here. This is my studio. I have a whole bunch of footage of this actually being built um, from, I think, I think it was like Vlogmas 20, 
2020 or 2021. I'm not exactly sure. I can link some of those videos, but right now I just kind of like it how it is. Very simple. I do want to get rid of this um, backing over here. I don't like the stripes. It actually drives me quite crazy. So I'm looking for something else to put behind there and kind of cover the wall. But I thrifted this piece of fabric um, that I thought was so gorgeous. Um, from Goodwill. So I've actually just been using this over my desk and these flowers were gifted to me from uh, Rose Forever a while ago and they're actually still holding up. These are over like eight months old. Um, really, really impressive. And then I just have a whole bunch of these cute little gold um, big cats that I like to change out to over there with my Betsy Johnson necklace. So this is definitely a fun space and I can't wait to keep working on it, revamping it. I also would like to get some lighting in here. Um, it's just a work in progress, you know? My husband actually was down picking avocados this morning. Um, we have a ton that we need to pick and I'm actually putting together some teachers baskets because my son is graduating eighth grade and I thought it'd be fun to just put some avocados in there and really just make it cute and fun with maybe like a little gift card for them. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to probably go up and do that. And if I finish them today, I will show you. And not much has changed with this uh, little path here since I have talked to you guys um, last and I don't even think I've done very many updates as far as home projects but there's always stuff going on um, with all of the rain that we had this past um, season in California everything is so gorgeous it is just green and lush and beautiful but also overgrowing so we've had to do a lot of tractor work out here um, right now we are trying to work on this path here so we're not really sure what we're gonna do um, but we really want to rebuild it make it nice cut all this stuff back and just get ready for summer Sorry if it's a little loud, my washing machine is going and my dogs are crying because they want to go outside. But these are the cute little baskets I got. I actually got these from Dollar Tree. I got five of them and then I got some thank you cards so we can personalize a little thank you note. I got these huge chocolate bars from, where did I get these, Aldi, um, to put in the teacher pack. I also got some ribbon, some like clear kind of glossy glittery ribbon. And then I also got some of this clear paper to make like a little basket, the um, the little clear wrap. And then we're gonna put avocados in here and it's gonna be really cute. I'm thinking about maybe a Starbucks gift card. Not totally sure yet, but this is just a simple way, an easy way to put together a gift. And while we're on the topic of uh, supplements, and I'm so sorry because it's so loud right now, my dryer is going, there's just, it's chaotic in my house today, but um, I am actually partnered with Goalie and I have been using Goalie products um, for a very long time and I absolutely love the company. Uh, they have fabulous customer service um, and I just wanted to show you guys a few of my faves right now. So I actually have this triple action immune gummy um, my son loves to take the super fruit gummies. They taste delicious. And then I take my apple cider gummies uh, religiously every single day and I have for a very long time. Now that brings me to the topic of the berberine. I'm going to show you the one that I use because Goalie actually does not currently make a berberine. Okay, so I am actually taking the Terry Naturally and it is a once a day dosage. Um, basically, it's because it has um, it has an extra... Not really sure how to put this. It has um, gamazorb in it. Let me see. Yeah, there it is. Gamazorb, which basically helps the absorption of the berberine because it um, can have some issues actually being absorbed in your body. So just this little extra natural um, gamma will help that. So this is a one a day. And then on the back here, it is 250 milligrams. Now the recommended dosage from this can vary, so it's really important that you talk to your doctor if you're taking anything else, any other supplements, um, any other medications. Um, there are some videos out there saying that this can lower your blood sugar too low. So if you have any issues with that, definitely consult your doctor. Always consult your doctor. As I mentioned, this is what's working for me and it might not work for you, but I really do love this um, once daily Terry Naturally. And as I mentioned, it does have the, um, the gamma sorb in it. So do a little research, see if it's something that might work for you. Talk to your doctor, but all of these are currently my go-tos right now. And I honestly think I'm gonna keep it super simple today for lunch. I was gonna do a recipe for you guys, but you know what? I'm just not feeling like cooking right now. Um, I'm actually 
turning 42 on Monday, so I'm calling this my birthday weekend. So I'm taking it easy. I'm gonna have some coffee. I'm gonna have a nice little Mexicali salad that I got from Trader Joe's. My absolute go-to, my fave. I go through so many of these throughout the week. They are just easy and delicious. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. If you haven't tried these, I would highly suggest picking them up. Delicious, you can add some salsa to it. Um, you can add some, you know, basically whatever you wanna add to it to kind of take it up a notch. Sometimes I'll even put like the Quest protein chips in here for like a little crunch. Delicious. I feel like it's just been so long since I've vlogged. I have been so busy, you guys, but here's Miss Pepperoni. Just Miss Pepperoni. She's just living her best life right now. Totally acting like uh, she doesn't see the camera. <laughs> pepperoni girl. Pepperoni. Pepperoni. And here's Miss Sugar Bear. Just relaxing. Just relaxing. And here we are in my bathroom. If you are an OG subscriber, you know that when I got this um, particular mirror, I used to vlog in here all the time. And I still love it just as much. So anyways, I love you guys so much. Why can't I get this right? I haven't done it in a while. Oh my goodness. I love you guys so very much. I will see you in my next video. Make sure that you subscribe and I'll see you soon.